Hello guys, this is Eric Saint-Ange and let's go ahead and create a squeeze page using the 90 second squeeze page generator. First you have to go in your browser, browser and type 90secondsqueezepage.com. You're going to end up on this page. Then you will have to create an, an account. You have to pick your username, email address, password and your Clickbank ID. If you don't have one, just click right over here and you'll be able to create one for free. Alright, let's go and log in. can write my name right. Here we are. All right, once you get into the, the dashboard, they call, you just click on that rectangle right here, create new page. Then everything is right there for you in seven steps. Let's start by step number one. You have to give your page a name. We'll, we'll call this one tutorial. <coughs> Excuse me. And then you have to choose a template. They all doing really good. They all convert really good. So um, let's go with number two. I like this one. Number three, you have to create a headline, something that's gonna catch the people's attention. You know. So let's go ahead with. Have you ever wanted to work from home? We'll we'll use this headline because today to create a squeeze page, we're gonna do it as this as if we would uh, promote .com secret X. All right. So now we've done we're done with the headline. Let's go number four. Then you have four choices. You either do put bullets, do a video, image, or not nothing. Let's the bullets is pretty pretty simple. I'll get back to it after. Video. What you have to do, you say they says they say here, just copy your video embed embed code and paste it here. So what you do, you can create a video, upload it to YouTube, and then you go to YouTube, you click I just pick whatever video you click on share here right here this one embed then they give you a HTML code highlight it copy it go back right here and then you're gonna put it right there as simple as that the image what you have to do <coughs> just enter the image URL that you you you, cho you choose uh, somewhere from online today we'll go with the bullets bullets is pretty simple pretty simple once you click on bullets this window will will pop up and it's pretty all the tools here are pretty much the same as you would have in word so it's pretty easy navigation so bullets let's take let's get rid of this click on the bullets there you go then your first bullet we remember we are promoting um, dotcom secret x which is a um, complete training for people to start their own internet marketing business so we got their attention with have you ever wanted to work from home? So let's keep going with, uh, say, own your oops, your own business. Let's put another one. Uh, be your own boss. Oops, let's change this letter here. See, these are two two bullets that pretty catchy you don't want to put too much you don't want to go ahead and give too much details on what you you offer because then they won't they won't go ahead and opt in put their e email uh, name and email to go in to find more you know they if you give them too much upfront then they will go ahead and they won't want to find more so you just go like this you know let me just make a bit more space make these a little bit bigger there you go so this, you know, have you ever wanted to work from home, own your own business, be your own boss? You'll be surprised. So many people are looking for that, you know. So that's why .com Secret X is converting so well, you know. So many people are taking this training, and actually, that's that's how I, uh, that's what made me what I'm here today, you know. I've been in internet marketing for a little bit, and was not able to be really successful. But once I stumble on on uh, .com Secret X, that's what change everything you know so let's keep going then you will have to go for your opt-in code okay give me a second I have to look for something the opt-in code there's three things you will have to take care of here the opt-in code right here it will come from your autoresponder that's um, a software you have that will be sending emails automatically to your the to people on your list. You can go with Aweber, GetResponse, GetResponse. Th these are the two main ones. There's some other ones. Me, I've been with uh, Aweber. I like it pretty much. 
So to fill up the opt-in code right here, let's go to Aweber. Once you signed in, just click on web form. Then you're going to end up on this page. Then you go ahead and create a new web form. When you get here, let me get rid of this. When you get here, you have tons of templates, you know, many fancy ones and like different designs. What I recommend you is just to go with the simple one. That's what converts the best. More, more glitters or more things you put on this, that's just gonna distract you, the people coming in the page, you know. You just want to give them the headlines, the opt-in box, that's what, that's what works the best. So I usually go ahead, trim this, trim this. The submit button right here, what I do is um, I put it usually, let me, um, I usually put it centered. And here, submit. I don't like the word submit, you know, I, I don't think it, it's really appealing. I like to change it. So what I go, I, what I do is I just go here, right, uh, let's say instant access. See, that's more catchy, you know. And here the email privacy thing. You can add some more, you know, but on, the only thing with Aweber is you cannot change this. You can, you just have to stay with, we respect your email privacy, which is fine. You can keep that, you know, and take take out the, the footer. But if you want to change that, see if you click edit, there's no way you can change it. You can you cannot change the text, you know, it's just where it's just, you cannot, ju you can just change where the alignment's going to be. So what I do usually, I remove it. I go right there, I go footer, then I, I write it here, you know, we respect your email privacy, and your email will never be shared. I made a few mistakes here, let me correct that really quick. Capitalize all of them. Okay. Just highlight these. Center it. Just looks better. Save it. And then, if you, if you want this just to look nicer here, you can always resize it. There you go. That's better. Okay, there you go. This is, we have your web form now. So let's go to step two. You want to name your web form? Let's name this one tutorial. Facebook integration. The Facebook integration, I personally don't use it, but it's if you en enable it, what's going to happen? It's when people they're going to see that box already their their um, name they use on Facebook is going to be there and their Facebook email, so they don't have to write anything in there. They just have to click. I mean, like I told you, I don't use it. Some people do. Some people say it helps their con conversion. Some people say it doesn't. It depends. I personally, like I said, I don't use it, so it's up to you. The thing with the squeeze page is you always want to, um, you will want to try different squeeze page, tweak it, you know, train, change the headlines, change the opt-in box. You'll see what works the best. Okay, so we did the form name. We decided decided not to go with the Facebook integration. Now the thank you page. You remember in the 90 second squeeze page, if I go back, they say use this thank you URL. Why they tell you that is because what's happening with the 90 second squeeze page, they will track how many people see your page and how many people opt in, how many people decide to put their name and email. So you want to use that. It's going to help you track everything. So highlight, copy, and paste it right here. You just have to go down the menu, Custom page, you put it right here. And same thing at the bottom here. Custom page. There you go. Now we go save web form. And we can go to step number three. Now you will have to go, I will install my form. It's because 90 seconds squeeze page, I will host your squeeze page. So what you want to do, you click here. You take that script here. You can either take the JavaScript or their raw HTML, which is the same. Let's just take this one, just one single single line. Let's go back to the 90 second squeeze page. 
this is the autoresponder opt-in code that's what I was telling you earlier then you just plug it right here destination URL you remember I was saying at the beginning with this headline and those bullets we'll be promoting .com secret X so what you want to put here it's where people are gonna be directed once they decide to put their name and email and click instant access so let me go get my affiliate link which is right here I go back there you go copy and paste it right here simple as that now we're done with step number five let's go to step number six exit pop-up this is pretty good that's you can get some some sales from here so what you want to do is what is the exit pop-up is people they will land on your squeeze page and if they they don't like what they see they don't want to put their name and email they're just going to go ahead and close the page so what happened if you use the exit pop-up one once they close the page they, they will have a pop-up <laughs> exactly what it's called pop-up come up on the screen and then you want to put some text here you know and say wait let's take this one wait don't leave yet I've got something for you this is one I just created really quick now you want to put maybe a bit more time into creating something you know something more personal to you something really catchy this is something pretty generic right here so they see this wait don't leave yet I've got something for you and they, they will have to, the option to either just leave the page or stay on the page so if they, they click stay on the page they will be directed to this exit pop URL right here so they decided not to go ahead with the .com secret X you know and they don't know it's .com secret X but they decided not to go with the squeeze page but what happened is you take your URL here you offer URL and you put it right here see so if you cannot get them to come in on your list in your bank of emails maybe you'll have them and have them buy the the course from Russell on .com secrets and then you'll make money off of that so you we've got everything covered now let me do a re quick recap so step one give your page a name name this one tutorial for today you choose a template one of the five one step number three headline the main headline have you ever wanted to work from home step number four I show you how to do these we decided to go on bullets today you put your bullets right here step number five we use that thank you URL to track our uh, page that this this one here we plugged it um, plugged it on the our autoresponder destination URL that's where people are going to land after they decide to put their name and email and click instant access and autoresponder opt-in code that's what we got from our web form generator on Aweber it was right here and then lastly but not the least exit pop-up we said yes put our text here put our affiliate link here and then that's it save and edit the squeeze page let's save that let's go have a look how, how it is oh by the way you see here grab your affiliate link that's how you can promote you can promote 90 second squeeze page as well this is always good you know all right highlight this that's your page we named it named it tutorial highlight this that's our page squeeze page URL copy this let's go right here put it there let's see how it looks Wow <laughs> have you ever wanted to work from home own your own business be your own boss who doesn't want to do that right so you go ahead and put your name and email. Let me put my name, email. There you go, it's right there. And instant access, click. There you go. I've been directed right to the .com secret X page. So then people, they will see that, that video here. It's a 15 minute video. It's, pretty, it's a pretty good video. You know, the, a lot of people go ahead and watch this and decide to add to the cart and see, look, how oh, it's a dollar for 30 day you know then they'll you'll get charged a regular the regular price which is just under 100 bucks a month which is pretty cheap for what Russell is providing you but you start with a dollar so you'll be you be crazy not to try it you know for 30 days you'll you can learn so much for just a dollar I, I would try it I mean that that's how I start like I told you I did it so all right it works we put our name and email ended up on the dot com secret x page but what if people remember here what if people 
Let's go back to our squeeze page. Let's leave this page. What if people end up here, like I said, and they decide not to put their name in email? They don't want to put any, any of this in there. So they decide, let's go ahead and close the page. Bam. Oh, our exit pop-up didn't work. What's happening? Let me go back right here. See? Well, you can always come back, go in here, you can edit your page. Exit pop-up. It's on. I don't know why it's, it's not, it didn't work. Let's go again. Successfully saved. Let's highlight this again. There we go. Let's put another page. Up, up. All right. So let's see if the exit pop-up works this time. We close it. There you go. Are you sure you want to leave this page? Wait, don't leave yet. I've got something for you. So they can go ahead and leave the page. They don't, they're not interested by it, you know, that's that's okay. Or they want they might decide to stay on the page. So stay on the page. Well, what do you have to offer? Oh, dot com secret eggs. What is that? You know? So that's it. Guys, we create our 90 second squeeze page. Like I showed you, everything was done right here. Seven steps. Pretty easy. You can do it pretty much faster than I just did. It's just because now I'm showing you through it, but it's it's pretty fast to do. And they convert pretty good, like I told you. Really good converting conversion, I should say. So this is it, guy. So uh, if you have any questions or uh, something something you want to ask me about internet marketing, so just go ahead and join my Facebook group, and uh, I'll, I'll be really glad to help you. So I hope you enjoy the today's tutorial and good luck with your internet marketing.